welcome MLM Online Champions, Pat McKeon here with my favorite buddy and my sponsor in MLSP and in my primary business as well. I, I'm just so honored that we met with here at uh, Live the Dream 2. I'm having a blast. How are you doing? Doing great. Right, yeah, it's great to see you. It's same, great to see you. Here, buddy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sorry, we, we've known each other about 11 months now and uh, you know, I just came into Jordan's team and basically got into his 100 day challenge and you know, started making money and actually my first online sales were with you. Yeah, absolutely, it's very exciting. Generating 12 deals, I generated 12 leads in like six hours or something like that. Remember I called you up, I was so excited. It's very but, exciting. But it was, it was really this gentleman's um, training that helped me do it and me getting on and doing it. So what do you have to say about uh, taking our business to the next level? Hmm. Can you be a little more, more specific? specific than that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and yeah. So basically people are doing now, people are continuing with the 100 day challenge and like my goal for them is to get more people into MLSP, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. in their primary. Yeah. How can we go about and do that? Well, you know, here's here's the big thing that I see, and I noticed this, this with a lot of speakers that talked about this. It's, it's about prospects, getting people in front of a presentation. And this is something I myself used to struggle with a lot. So if you're struggling with this too, it's not your fault. You maybe you're, you're not used to this. Uh, is getting people onto a presentation. How do I get someone to watch that? How do I get someone to look at a business opportunity presentation? You know, you're, you're, you might be thinking this exact thing right now as you're watching this video. And, and the thing that I, I used to struggle with was how do I actually ask someone to take a look at a video? Right. It's a silly question. And all you have to do is just ask them, hey, are you open to taking a look at what we do? Right. Hey, do you have this problem? They come to you, they opt into your mailing list, or, or they're, they're, they're viewing your website, they're looking at your videos, your content, because they have certain problems in their life. They're struggling with, they don't know how to market, they don't know how to generate leads, they don't know how to make money with their business. They don't, maybe they don't even have a business and they're looking for a way to make money outside of their job, outside of what they're currently doing. And so they come seeking online to seek all this information, maybe just like you and I did. Right. And, and they find it, and then we're afraid to ask the question. But, what do you want? What do you want? And are you open to take a deeper look at it? You know? and, 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 and the thing is, that's all you really have to do. When someone comes to you and they say, hey, this is my problem, and you say, okay, if I can show you a way to solve that problem, are you open to taking 30 minutes of your time to take a deeper look at what we do? Right. And why do you want to solve that problem? And then you just get them on a presentation. I mean, seriously, that's the big thing, and that's where most people struggle. Like, you know, I, I watched Ray Higgins or Tracy Walker talk about prospecting. I listened to, to, to uh, Todd Falcone talk about prospecting. I listened to all the speakers and they talk about the, the, the main deal is getting people onto a presentation. And a lot of people think it's about leads, it's about marketing, it's about, you know, uh, how many blog posts did I write? That's all good stuff, but it doesn't matter. It does matter. But at the end of the day, it's about can you get people onto a presentation? Can you ask them if they're open to pulling out their credit card and giving them money? In other words, helping people to change the quality of their life. That's that's the more important part. It's just they come to you looking for an answer to right. a problem. Right. Them giving you money is, is is then going to get them the solution to their problem. Right. So. Don't feel like you're just taking their money. Feel like you're offering. If you don't feel like you're offering that person a solution with what you're selling, with what you're offering, you need to look at something else, honestly. So, so that's the key thing is just really get get confident in what it is that you're promoting, get confident in what it is that you're marketing, and, and feel good about asking people if they're open to really taking a look and solving their problems. And what you can do is connect with Pat here. She's awesome. She's going to give you her website. Right now www.patmckeon.com. Jordan, it's been a pleasure working with you. I look forward to continuing. Thanks a lot. How do I make it stop? You just let it keep going and she does. There we go. Thank you, Jordan.